The bike is on fire Here in Valley Soleil, we have a lot of steep climbs like that, and uh, steep climbs are part of mountain bikes. So we are going to see how to manage with them to keep traction and control and uh, stay on the bike. First thing, of course, it could seem obvious, but it's about the gears. You need to have the right uh, gear to go right in a, in a steep climbs. If you go with a too big gear, then you won't be smooth and uh, it will be too hard, simple to pedal on the steep climbs. And if you have a too small gear, then maybe you may lose balance and control. And so you have to find the right compromise and also always anticipate. So look in front of you, see how it goes and anticipate to have the right gear. The two main problems people have in a steep climb is about traction and control. Traction is about keeping your grip on the rear wheel to help your bike go ahead, of course. And the control, it's about keeping control with your front wheel, uh, going where you want to go and not having the front wheel always uh, being out of the ground. First thing is about control because, uh, of course, when you're on a steep climb, you naturally have less weight on the front wheel and on the front of your bike. So if you don't have weight, it doesn't touch the ground at all or you don't have enough weight so that your front wheel leads your bike. Uh, the solution is to move a bit your body on the front of your bike, on the front of your saddle. So your pelvis must be a bit on the front of your saddle and your chest then has to be a bit lower on the bike like that. And it gives more weight on the front of the wheel and then you, will, you will gain control and go where you want simply. Then there is a traction because of course if your rear wheel is sliding then it doesn't uh, help your bike move ahead and then you go out of the bike. Uh, to have traction, that's the contrary, you need to keep some weight on the rear wheel. So it's about a balance but first it's again about the gear. If you have the right gear it allows you to keep pedaling smoothly and it's a key part of keeping traction, then you have to choose the right line. Sometimes you need to choose the right tire to have a good grip and uh, a lower pressure may help you to have more grip and then to keep traction. Be careful if you lower the pressure, the risk is to have puncture the next downhill. So in summary, riding the steep climb is mostly about body position and pedaling smoothly and practice as well. I hope these little tricks will help you ride steep climbs easily. Rice and chocolate, the new menu you for the to. race. I still have to uh, find out new recipes before race day. So uh, this is one of them actually. I did it at the Europeans as well. Rice and some black chocolate. And uh, yeah, the rice tastes a little bit better than Thank you. Okay. So I am riding the hardtail in Val d'Isle. Um, obviously we've got two really good bikes to choose from um, and this course I think is half is half is good for a hardtail and half is good for the full suspension. Um, but I have decided to use the hardtail because uh, I want to be able to really compete on the on the climbs so I've gone for the the stiffer slightly lighter bike for the climbing there's quite a lot of a lot of corners on the climbs where you have to kind of keep accelerating and and half of it is if you have the full suspension it's easier to carry the speed but then actually for the the pure acceleration the hardtail is better so uh, yeah it's a bit of a bit of an either or course but no I'm gonna go for the hardtail and um, yeah hopefully we get stuck into the climbs for the work up here in Val di Sole, I gonna take my full suspension, the Orbea Ois. Uh, I like it very much on this track because it's it's bumpy everywhere, and uh, also there are some uh, technical climbs, which I can use the extra 
traction when I open the full suspension, also in the climbs, and it makes it much smoother for me for a whole racing distance. It's much more comfort, and I think uh, I can save energy in this way and use it for uh, more power. At the moment, it's so hard for me to race. My uh, my body is not 100%. But uh, I need to see the small progress, and then um, I was better than last weekend at Europeans. So um, yeah, small small steps on the way, but hopefully it's uh, it's gonna get there at one point. But yeah, but I'm so thankful for the team support. The Pierre, our manager, was on the track even though I'm almost dead last and he's keeping on chewing on me and yeah, it means, it means the world when you're out there, so yeah, super thankful. Yeah, it was a tough race for me. I do a good start because I start on a four row, so it wasn't uh, easy to, to go on the front. And uh, I joined the top 10, but uh, after my legs, it was uh, not really good. And uh, it was a bad day for me. Next week, I, I hope to, to join the top uh, five, maybe. And uh, if, I, if I do that, uh, I'm happy. <laughs> could move up pretty fast to top 15 and then I had a constant speed every lap I could uh, catch up some riders until middle of the race there I had a little problem I lost uh, around maybe 15 seconds it was a little bit hard to find myself again back in the race eighth place and uh, I'm pretty happy with this and uh, I'm confident for the rest of the season and uh, I can do more I know and uh, one time everything fits together and then uh, I'm on the podium but it's on the everything it's on the right way yeah just uh, speechless again <laughs> yeah I, I, the, the story was not so good I had actually quite a bad start and uh, it felt like I lost a lot of places and I had to catch up from behind but uh, you know from the first lap on I was just doing my own pace and uh, you know, I think it was two laps before the end. I saw, I looked on the screen, and I saw I was top ten. I was really surprised. And then uh, I saw a few guys in front of me, and you know, I thought, ah, let's go, let's go for it. Just, just take them. And then, uh, you know, uh, it was unbelievable. I could just go and go and go and push and push, and the last climb was just all out, all out, and then six. You know, it's amazing. I'm, I'm so happy. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> it's unbelievable. <laughs>